All right, uh, part two here. As uh, these touch screens are pretty touchy. So this is from the Extreme Speed Series, the Callaway C7. Isaiah picked this one up. He thought it might be fast. Um, we do have a fantasy. Um, Race. Uh, yeah. I don't think he's that fast. Um, we do have a lot of fantasy cars. This one might car? be in. Yeah, we're gonna try it. And boom, 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 boom. <laughs> side splitter from the splatter paint series. I'm yes. actually going to. We fast, already fast, got. Fast, fast. He, this is number four on your lineup already. So we're gonna probably encapsulate him and just keep him hanging on the wall in the collection. Next up, uh, Isaiah found a couple of Mercedes Benz. Oh, there's uh, one McLaren and one GLE Coupe. Uh, yeah, this is actually a McLaren. Mercedes. SL SLR Mercedes McLaren. Yep. So uh, oh. those might be in a luxury race. Or just a Matchbox race. Or a Matchbox race. They are both from Matchbox. Next up, this car will definitely be on Team Ford. Ford Anglia. I think it's Anglia. I, yeah, I don't know. I only got it. We only got it because we don't really have it. Yeah, we do, we. I haven't seen one of these, so uh, we're looking forward to getting this one on the track. And we picked up another Batman Batmobile. We do have a a Batman collection that's uh, mostly tucked away right now in a box. Huh. But uh, so he'll be added to the collection there. Batmobiles usually aren't fast. All right, so next up from the Speed Blur series, uh, the Track Manga. I have a collection of these. Uh, I like these cars. I don't know why. Um, some of them are fast. Some of them are slow. But I like these particular cars. Uh, kind of so looks I, like a Mustang almost. Yeah, kind of does. But I got this one because I don't have it. All right, next up it's going to be from the Nightburner series. It is a Lamborghini Huracan LP 622 Super Trofeo. Runner up for the longest Hot Wheel name? <laughs> yeah, you ain't kidding. It is a 2016. I think it's pretty sharp. There aren't many Lamborghinis I've ever found that were fast on the track. I don't know why. They're just kind of like... Especially not competitive fast. But this will be in a future race. Or on the shelf. Or on the shelf. I like how it's standing up like it's revving. 2013 copyright. It's the Sweet Rides 68 Mercury Cougar. This is my personal uh, favorite casting and uh, car in real life. Um, it's fast because obviously... The Camaro is... Uh, It's probably my, my second favorite, but the second. Cougar, the Cougar is my first. If I had a choice of something to have in my driveway, um, this would be it. 68 Cougar Eliminator. But what would we in a race, a Camaro or a Cougar? Ah, uh, that's a tough choice. Does it depend on the year? Oh, yeah! Yeah, I forgot about this one. It's the 81 DMC DeLorean. Ooh! 2012 Ooh. copyright. Pretty cool. Opening rear. Oh, yep. Well, he's going to be open up on the track. He's cool. He is pretty cool, huh? I don't know. That's probably either my third or second favorite car of all time. Not performance-wise. Yeah, perform cool. <laughs> performance-wise in real life is pretty shady, but on the track, they can be fast. He's cool. All right, next up, one of the few matchbox we got is the super fast Pontiac. GTO Judge. We know who's going to be picking this car in the race. <laughs> this will be featured in a Hot Wheels versus Matchbox race later on in the season. Oh, yeah. All right, up next, another one of my favorites is the Hot Bird from the Cars of the Decade series. Really sharp ride. Nice one. I do like this one. Man, our Redline collection is building. Yeah. Up next is a 90 T-Bird. I think I ordered this one because I thought it was fast. We'll try it again. We're definitely going to try him out. He's got a lot of chrome. 
but I like those wheels. That's what that's what attracted me to this car was the wheels. So next up from the Hot Wheels Classics is the 69 Camaro Red Lines. Specs of Flame paint. Metal body, metal base. He's Yeah, he's registering at 574. Felt like 39, 30. All right, so next up is going to be an 81 Camaro. 2012 new model series. Possibly. Yeah. He's coming in at 48.7. He's not that heavy. No, it'd be 36 grams. Still not that heavy. Next up Ooh, from the Mardi Gras series. This is a metal body, metal base. But the opening hood, I can see the hinges yeah. on it. 53.7 in the package. 67 Camaro convertible. I'm looking forward to getting this one on the track. All right, up next is... The 67 Camaro. This one's from the 50, um, 50th Camaro uh, series. And uh, alongside it open there is the original. Um, got that over at uh, one of the antique stores. So this is the, uh, well, the remake. Or the, so it has like the same paint job. But you see it has the five hook wheels, plastic base. But... Then, the original has the same paint, but it has black wall wheels and metal base. All right, next up is a convertible concept from the Heat Fleet. Didn't that turn into a real car or something? 09 Camaro. If it's a concept? Yeah. It looks like an actual one. It's a pretty nice paint job. I, I like, like the paint job. I if like you the... did a custom, keep that paint job. Yeah, on. I like that fire. It's cool. It is pretty cool. It is an Independence Day, 4th of July, metal body, metal base Camaro Z28. He's going to be fast down the track. You should not open it. Oh, yeah. He is definitely going to be ripped and raced. No! All right. Next up, we picked up a few Ferraris. This is a 2001 Ferrari 348. I really can't wait to get these sports cars out on the track <laughs> then from the gold medal speed series 58.7 he's cool the gold medal speed ferrari testarossa white faded blue car oh yeah tan interior mm, he's gonna be a fast one Hurry. and then we have the gold medal speed Ultra Hots, Ferrari F40. Oh, he is a blue card. <laughs> mint condition. Boy, he's going to look good going down the track. And fast. Coming in at 63.1 in the pack. Alright, and last up, before we turn it over to Isaiah, for the Supers, the Treasure Hunts, I found this Majorette set. Special ones. Um, it comes with a... Uh, play map. Yeah, with a play map. And it's got the... Uh, 1990 one? Yeah, I believe it is a 1990 Mercedes. Okay, so it is a 1990 copyright Majorette pack. And it's got the uh, Renault on the bottom. And the Mercedes on the top. Nah, I haven't decided if I'm going to open these or not. I, I would keep it in. I I, I might keep it in until no, I, not gonna be <clears throat> until I find another one. You never know. You never know what's going to be fast. I think that Mercedes would be fast, but you never know that Renault could be fast too. Okay. Isaiah here, and now on with like the special cars, supers, treasure hunts. So we got the remake of. These older kind of ones, style ones, the 77 Plymouth Arrow. Definitely a fast one down the track as Dad shows examples with his cars. Well, this is actually that particular model there is number five on your race team. You have it loose. And he is pretty fast. But now we have him to hang on the 
on the wall. And next up is the 2003 Bugatti Veyron. <coughs> I'm pretty sure it's either 2001 or 2002 copyright date, but this... 2003. Yep, that's a 2003 copyright. 2003 copyright. This is a very cool car. So, we got two of them, but we're showing off this one. The nicest package, in my opinion. This one, very cool. We picked up another one of these, uh, Larry Wood 50th Anniversary Collections, the Gold Bone Shaker. We actually picked it up for um, another collector. Uh, we picked it up for trade. Yep. We're going to trade it off to a guy that's looking for this one. Um, yeah. Pretty cool car still. Here's a cool Mustang 007 Diamonds Forever 71 Mustang Mach 1. Yeah. I like the Mustangs. I like the Mach 1. I do like that car. And I think that car is going for a little bit of change. That's why we're going to keep it in the pack. It's in a set with the Ashton Martin. A bunch of other cars. But the Mustang, cool. This is one of the favorites of my dad's that we got from Timber Dan, the Super Chrome's Roger Dodger with the five silk red lines on it. And with that van, which we have, which is kind of cool. That is pretty neat, yeah. I'd like to find that van in the package. <laughs> that would be neat. That would be neat. Next, we got some cool classics. We don't have too many of these ones, so... This one is the 68 Olds 442. Nice fire tampos. Nice wheels. He's coming in around 92.4? Am I reading that right? No, it might be off. Actually, uh, yeah, that's because it's in the Protecto pack. Oh, the Protecto is making it way heavier. <laughs> way heavier, yeah. And this one is my favorite out of the two we got. The 67 Firebird, Firebird 400, Hot Wheels Cool Classics. I like the green. Looks really cool. And the same wheels as the old 442, but I like this one. Here's that Corvette we were talking about in part one. As you see, it has different card. Not the white stripe, but same paint, same wheels. I think, personally, this one looks a little bit better than the other one. This one's super neat. 69 Corvette. This one, a really heavy casting. Part of the Hot Ones series. The Long Gone. This one will be a cool one for any race. Future races. It could be in a future race. I am so um, contemplating um, whether to open that or not. I just found one of these. And um, I've been looking for one of these for a while. So I'm, I'm just glad to have one. And uh, when I find another one, I, th I think we're going to be searching for another one so we can just open it too. He's real cool. Now all we have left is the treasure hunts and super treasure hunts. First up for the regular treasure hunt, we got the Hot Wheel City Treasure Hunt Fire Eater. Um, I'm pretty sure he's a is 2012 it? copyright date on him. A very cool casting. I like the Fire Eater. He's cool. Then we got the Ferrari 599XX. This is not the Super, unfortunately, but still Ferrari. Still a cool car and collectible. This has to be one of my favorite Supers. It's very neat. It's the 71 Mustang funny car. I think the wheels on this is one of the best for the Supers, personally. Spectre's Flame Paint. He's neat. Real quick, here's an old Lesney matchbox. This is a Mustang, but the cool thing about this one is that it has this turning wheel. Sometimes it breaks, but it's an old one. It's, it's, an, it's, it's really old, but, it's pretty but you can move it with this and it's, you can turn the wheels and it's real cool. I like it. And last up is the pawn shop find. It is the Super Treasure Hunt Ferrari 599XX. I could not believe it. Isaiah told me to encapsulate this right away. Um, and then I found out what these things are going for. Um, I gave $15 for it. 
That was it. Crazy. And I got another car with it that it's going to be hitting the track. But, um, yeah, so those are, um, those are the Timber Dan Hall finds. We're looking forward to racing and, uh, look forward to the racing and opening of. Yeah. And, uh, Jim. so we hope you enjoyed, uh, please like comment and subscribe what your favorite car was, uh, out of these videos. And, um, we certainly appreciate you folks, and we look forward to the next haul video, which will probably be... NASCAR. Um, no, that's going to be the next... Um, race? Blister Pack race, yeah. But uh, the next one will probably be uh, Brass Armadillo, huh? Yep. So, from all of us here at Elevation Diecast Racing, we'll see you soon.